That's here in transition. Back set to Ebony Wanabu. Block. Wanabu and Jordan Dunn up front for SC. And they are the hitters, and it really disrupts the tempo. Taylor Formico playing the barrel for UCLA. Has it go right off her hand? 5-4. Yeah, but there's one. You gotta get back in. Going right back out to Precio. Exactly what you should do as a setter. Looking for a two-point lead for the first time. Again, the float serve. As they handled by Whittingham. And then right down the middle. Alicia, this is the third time early in this match they've had to give a free ball away to UCLA. But Jordan Dunn erases it with the block. Alley alone to get that to fall. Amy, if you don't celebrate a win, a kill, is that because you're just tired? At the end of that? Yeah, nobody for UCLA celebrated that point. Jeans come from mom. Pass cars to low. And you have, you're trying to watch three different players, and now you've got a quick back row coming. It's so difficult. It's always fun. Carly Trollson. Block of the net, kept up strongly. Just shovel it. Up in Seattle in that Big Ten Pac-12 showdown. And I asked uh, Mick Haley about it before. I said, what was the story with the three game? Formico. It's a tip by Ebony Wanabu. But it would be sweet for him to get his 100th against the Crosstown rival and his mentor, Mick Haley. Back row dig carries over and wide. That we've been accustomed to, but not enough. Taylor Wheatley just came in for SC to serve first time we've seen her tonight. So, since the end of the first set. Carstolo blocked it down. We're tied at 23. Resale bombs. Overpass. SC by one.